motivo de tu amor Locura de pasión Eterno corazón uh, We have done some snow queen And sounds been pretty good We're a little bit apprehensive about the boat trip With the kids But it was okay It was okay Cuervo y una flor Uh, welcome to My Outdoor Family episode number four. Uh, last week we were in Mexico for seven nights and seven days and it was awesome, it was really good. So And we got heaps of footage. Sam was in absolute kitty heaven. He was swimming like five times a day. Uh, there was The weather was awesome, it was like 28 degrees, 30 degrees every day. Uh, lots of sunscreen and he refused to wear his hat, which is kind of annoying, but didn't get fried so that was good but, but anyway so this week enjoy some some Mexico footage uh, it was really fun and, and we're still adjusting to life back at the back in Vancouver enjoy So here we are in Sayulita and lots of little trinkets that are pretty colourful, which I think Sam quite likes. Hey Sam, how are you finding it? We had a little play on the beach, now we're looking for somewhere for lunch. Uh, we like Mexicans, so we'll probably find something authentic. Bit of a, a little bit of a hippie town, lots of surfers. Um, very busy compared to Puente de Mita. But kind of cool, I'm enjoying it actually. These guys were here two days ago when I played golf. Uh, so they've been, they've already roamed the streets, but it's all new to me. Okay, signing off. So one of the great things about our trip is that we went with some friends of ours uh, who also had a, a one-year-old and that was amazing because no one gets another family's kid struggles like another family that has a kid the same age. Uh, so. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. La 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 casa del merengue. Okay, so nail and fail. What do we nail? I think we definitely know the location and the fact that we went to a small kind of little village rather than Puerto Vallarta or Cancun or one of the major Mexico destinations. That was awesome because it meant the kids could run wild and no one really cared, you know, and we weren't waiting for like places by the pool and stuff. Um, so we nailed that, the location worked out well and the, and the fact that we didn't do the all-inclusive was worked for us. Um, certainly not for every family but it, it worked for us. What did we fail? Um, I think coming back and adjusting back into like apartment life, that was a bit of a fail. Sam was like going nuts for two days. He was just like, get me out of here. He was so used to having miles of beach to run and play and swimming all the time. And so for two or three days, he was just psycho. Like he wouldn't sleep and he was just literally like swinging his arms around wanting to, wanting to just play. And so... We didn't anticipate that and that was kind of challenging for us settling back in and we went straight back to full time work and of course that was hard. So yeah, that that was Música, música. 